Today's video is all about these heated gloves. Perfect for this time of year, obviously. I'm going to go through the specification, how much they cost, and then we'll go through a detailed review of them and how they work. Snow Deer heated gloves. I'll go through the specifications, what I actually think of them, how easy they are to use, and, uh, and just how great I actually find them. The actual construction of the gloves are a lycra and neoprene on the outside. There's also a more substantial material around the wrist and inside it's a, it's a fleece so it's breathable. The actual heating element of the glove uh, is a, an infrared fibre, whatever that is, but that heats up the whole of the back of the hand and the fingers. And the batteries themselves, well, they're 7.4 volt, 2200 milliamp rechargeable lithium polymer batteries. The length of time that the batteries will last, well, if it's on high, which was the red setting, you're going to get between two to two and a half hours, and that's 140C through to 150C. If you go to the medium setting, that's the white indicator. Uh, that's going to be around about three and a half hours, three to three and a half hours. And that's a 122C to 131C. And if you're on the lowest setting, you get a whopping six and a half hours, but that's, that's down to 100C through to about 113C. I'll go through the gloves in a bit more depth in a moment, but let's just have a look what was in the box. So you've got the gloves. And obviously the battery that's provided for each glove. I'll just take that out so you can see that coming out. That's the battery and it's a first size battery that. It disconnects, all you do is just pull that out and then put it on charge. Uh, so two batteries, two gloves and in addition to that, it's a really nice box as well. And to be honest with you, when you're paying the sort of money that you're paying for these, roughly £90 upwards, um, you expect not only quality, which these obviously are, but you expect it to be presented well as well. So here's the charger. We'll go through that in more detail also. You get a bag to protect the gloves. Ta -da. And uh, obviously the batteries come separate when you first get it or come separately in the box when you first get it. So that's what's in the box. We'll go through the charger as I say in a moment. I'm going to pop this battery back in. As I said, just pushes in like that and then back into the pocket on the back. Now, although they glove liners, when you actually put them on, you can quite easily use these as gloves out in the wild without any, uh, without any further gloves over the top. But the whole point of them is, is, as I said, they are a glove liner. So you simply get your glove of choice, and these are Timbaland ones, and push them in. And, right, now that is your glove. This is so toasty warm, it is absolutely unbelievable. So again, because it's a glove liner, if you're on a bike, if you've got fishing gloves, riding gloves, whatever it is, then these gloves easily fit inside. They are, they are very, very thin. And that means that you can use the gloves that are specific to the task that you're actually doing, yet still keep your hands warm with these gloves. So we'll take those off. If you are using the gloves by themselves like this, and I use them uh, to walk the dog, it's not snowing at the moment, it's just cold. So this is how I'm using them. When the weather gets worse, I will be using other gloves on top of that. But if I'm using them like this, on the thumb and forefinger, you can use these on touch sensitive screens. So you can not only tap, open, etc. You can also pinch and zoom as well. All right, let's have a look at them in more detail. So we'll see the battery compartment. And if we just open that up, you've got your battery there. There's the specification on it. And again, just pull it and take it away to recharge it. Something that I really liked was when they came, they actually come with a cap that goes over the top. So if you haven't got your batteries in and you want to put that in there, you're not going to get any dirt or anything inside that. And also that's not going to damage the inside of this pocket. So that's good. Let's just close that back up again before we go and show you how to recharge that. And if I just flip them over, there's the 
button on the back to have the high, medium or low setting. And you've also got this toggle here so that you can close it up onto your sleeve. And again, the construction is lycra and neoprene. It's stretchy, you can see that, stretchy on the fingers. On the forefinger and on the thumb, where are we? There we go. On the thumb and on the forefinger, that's the material so that you can use it on a touch screen. And we'll just see it on, put it on the right one. See how easy it fits on. And also you'll see what a perfect fit it is as well. As I said, these are medium. Um, I'll put the other one on. And I'll put the chart up as well because I use the chart and they're an absolutely perfect fit for me. Right, so that's it. That's the gloves and the liners. Let's see them on charge. Not only are the batteries compact and powerful, uh, they're also extremely easy to charge. So this is the adapter that comes with it. And you've got a double adapter there and you simply get the plug, pop it into the battery. You'll see a red light comes on there. Get the second one. So the red light says it's actually charging or in need of charge. Get your second one, get that on charge as well. And when the batteries are fully charged, it takes between, from empty, it takes from between three to four hours. That LED will change to green, which means that the batteries are fully charged and ready for use. In summary then, heated snow day gloves. I am so impressed with these. Um, very, very comfy to wear. You've seen that because the glove liners, they fit inside whichever daily gloves you want to use, dress gloves, bike gloves, dog walking gloves, doesn't matter, these will fit in. The heat on them, the heat panels are only over the back of the hand, which is a good thing because you don't necessarily want anything on the inside there. And I was out the other day with my wife and it was probably the first time that she's held my hand in ages, which was simply because the heat radiating off these gloves, they weren't in another pair of gloves, I was just wearing them like this. They were keeping her hands warm while she was holding my hands. These are a medium. Uh, there is a, a size chart that you use and I use that to ensure that I got the right size. They're an excellent fit. Because they're lycra and neoprene, there's a lot of stretch in there. So even if I had larger hands, these would still be okay. Easy to turn on, press the button and you're away. They warm up relatively quickly. You're talking a, a minute and you're, you're almost up to full temperature at that. Again, you choose what temperature you want. You're probably going to, oh yeah, there we go, kicking in already. Uh, you're probably going to be using a lower temperature than the maximum in another pair of gloves because they are really, really warm. And really the benefit over these as compared to the rechargeable ones that you can hold in your hands, they're great for keeping your hands warm, but you can't do anything. Or, or you can put them in your pockets and then put your hands in your pockets. But if you're actually doing anything, you can't have those in your hand with heated gloves like these, you can be driving, you can be riding, you can be, you can pretty much be doing anything and you're going to get the benefit of that heat that's transmitting through the gloves. Not something that you're going to get with the rechargeable handheld hand warmers. So is it a recommendation? It's an absolute recommendation. As I said, they're not cheap, but there's quality to these when you put them on. You can feel the quality and you can see the quality. You've got an excellent length of battery time, even on like I said, maximum heat. And these, these are really, really warm now. Um, not uncomfortably warm, but very, very warm. So even on this setting, with two and a half hours worth of, um, of heating, you can't knock that. And unfortunately for me, my wife tried them on and she wants a pair now for when we're out walking Milo. What a worthy addition to the dog walking regime. Absolutely fantastic. And the weather now is turning so that these are going to be a necessity. A perfect fit. Now these are a medium to large and I don't have the biggest hands so, and there's a lot of stretch in them as well. Uh, but you've got your three settings on there. I've currently got it on high, purely and simply because it's cold and I should have brought a hat. Uh, but yeah, so you've got your three settings. That's where your batteries go. Not big and bulky and because it's underneath, it's not getting in the way of anything. And if you're out walking at night, well, with the light on, whether it's the red light, the white light or the blue light, you're actually going to be uh, visible when it's dark. So that's another benefit as well. Stretchy gloves, just really warm. And all the heating elements are in the back, so they don't get in the way of your hand. And obviously, finally, you've got the fact that you can use your finger on the phone, which is a good thing if you've got a touchscreen phone and you want to get them out of your pocket without getting cold.